Hello Nation. Today we're going to talk about sick day rules. Now what the heck are sick day rules? Every person with diabetes needs to know about them. And I want to split it up between type 1 and type 2 diabetes. Now if you have type 1 diabetes, obviously you're on insulin, either pump or multiple daily injection. Your pancreas doesn't secrete any insulin at all or extremely little. And what happens when you get sick? You get the flu. You don't feel like eating. And the last thing on earth you want to do is say to yourself, I'm not going to take any insulin because I'm not eating anything because I'm not hungry. But guess what? When you're sick, your body needs more insulin, not less, even if you're not eating a single thing. This is extremely important. So what do you do when you're sick? Drink lots of fluids. Test your blood sugar very frequently, and hopefully by now, if you've ever listened to me in the past, you're wearing a continuous glucose monitor. And please continue your basal insulin for sure, and take little squirts of fast acting depending on your blood sugar and your correction factor. So once again, it's so important to test and not withhold your insulin. Now, if you're a type two, If you're on pills, it's not the end of the world to skip your pills here and there, especially if you throw up anything you put in your stomach. But but theoretically, you should really continue all of your medications. If you're a type 2 on insulin, your body probably secretes some insulin uh, by itself in addition to the extra you take. And I still encourage you to take your basal insulin and only use the fast acting if you're high. And if you get really sick, you know, for anybody, no matter what type of diabetes you have, just call your caregiver. For those of you uh, that, that are on insulin or have diabetes, good to wear an alert bracelet and or a necklace, thanks to my good friend Ian Bloomer. And, for, and that way, if something happens, if you pass out, someone knows that you have diabetes. Now, if you're really sick and you have to barf like this, um, they'll... The main reason I'm telling you this is because I was sick on a, on a Southwest Airlines flight one day. I took out the barf bag and guess what? No one would sit next to me. So now when I fly, I ask the stewardess, when I get on the plane, is the flight full? She says no. I'll get out the barf bag. I'll sit just like this. I won't look up. And when everyone else walks by me, no one will sit next to me. As soon as the plane takes off, I put that away, spread out my laptop. And if there's one empty seat on this plane, it's right there. So long, nation.